Hey campers, today we are making Waldorf chicken salad and it's a really good day or a really good recipe for a travel day um, or a day that you just don't feel like doing much. I'm Christy. I'm Jason. I'm Aubriella. And, and this is... is... And we, we are... I Want to Camp With You. It's a beautiful night. We're looking for some fun to do. Hey campers, I think I want to... Hey campers, okay, so we have a super easy recipe for you today or tonight. Um, today was a travel day and we actually had a bit of a further travel than usual. I think it took us about five hours for our trip, so I really didn't want to have something hard. So anyways, um, I made chicken salad. Um, well, Waldorf chicken salad. And I forgot the nuts at home, so we're just going to say whatever. But anyway, I wrote down the measurements so I could tell you. Um, for every 10 ounces of chicken, so what I did was I cooked the chicken breast in the oven all in like a baking dish. I actually did it, I think, uh, like three or four days before we left. Um, I cut it all up into little pieces and then I put it in a bag, put it in the freezer. The day before we left, I took it out of the freezer and I mixed it in um, with all the rest of the ingredients, put it in here, put it in the camper fridge so it was ready for today. So anyways, for every 10 ounces of cooked chicken, you can use whatever type you want. I use chicken thighs, um, boneless, skinless chicken thighs because I like them. So you will do two tablespoons of mayo. Now these are like give or take. So if you like a little bit less, just lean less and you can always add more. Two tablespoons of mayo, um, two tablespoons of sour cream or Greek yogurt. I use sour cream, I like it better. One teaspoon of Dijon mustard, quarter teaspoon of onion powder, like an eighth to a quarter teaspoon of salt, an eighth to a quarter teaspoon of pepper, two tablespoons of dried cranberries, three tablespoons of chopped pecans, or you can use walnuts, um, any type of nuts that you want. Like I said, I forgot them at home, unfortunately. I did not add them to the salad because Aubriella does not like them in hers, so we we're gonna add them after the fact. Um, and then a quarter cup of grapes sliced um, or quartered, depending on how big they are. My child is not choking, she's actually baking, so I'm sorry about that. She's Cecilia, would you please stop? Okay, it's, yep, it's just water, you'll be okay. Um, okay, usually I would buy a hard roll, but chicken salad I think is actually better on a softer roll, so I went with the um, Walmart brand hamburger rolls that they bake fresh in the deli. So you're gonna take that, we like lettuce, so I'm just gonna take one piece of lettuce and put that on the top part of it. It looks really yummy. Oh, let me get a close really up. Yummy. So a cheat on the chicken would be rotisserie chicken yeah, from... Yeah, you could use rotisserie chicken from the deli. The deli. It would be just as good. Especially when they run it on sale because it sat there the day. Yeah, sometimes And it wasn't half sold. Price. Yeah, half price. Alright, let's see here. Then you probably want to cut the salt out. Yeah, do not use <laughs> salt. If you do that, do not use salt. For sure. Because they load them down with salt and butter. I'm trying not to make a huge mess. But anyways, the chopped walnuts or pecans do make a difference. I think it makes a huge difference. I, I like it in there, but like I said, I accidentally forgot them because, well, we packed for a two-week trip. So if that's all I forgot, then we're in business. The grapes and cranberries grapes make Grapes and cranberries awesome. make a really big difference, too. Okay, so that's it. it. Takes you like two seconds once you get to camp, and it tastes like a fresh homemade meal. Super good. Give it a try. Let us know what you think. Thanks for watching. Hey campers, if you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe and hit the like button. And hit that bell. Hey.